Bo-Katan's gauntlets I printed in nine pieces, two tops, two bottoms, and five small detail pieces. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, it's getting colder and I'm running low on patience and these prints are mostly pretty good. So I skipped a bunch of sanding and filling on these that I probably shouldn't have. But sometimes when your piece has a lot of colors and detail and weathering on it, you can kind of get away with it. Some of the details are painted in silver and gold. And the body of the gauntlet after I painted it silver, I masked some spots with cake icing this time and it worked great. It wasn't runny, it was easy to rinse off. After I painted them blue and got the icing off, I got a great chipped look. I should have glued all the pieces together before painting, but oh well. I just sanded a couple of rust spots and used E6000 and then some good old weathering. When you add paint for weathering, always make sure you're blotting and not wiping or brushing to get a realistic dirt look. I used a combination of paint and watered down paint and blotted it all with a paper towel. Last step, I just used gaff tape on the inside to make a hinge on one side and put Velcro on the other as a closure and done. All that's left armor-wise is the shoulders.